I'm Jane Hansen, and today we're going to knock the ahs, the ums, and the you knows out of you. <laughs> and I'm Mary Savello. For years, Jane and I anchored the news together in New York, and now we want to bring you news from our work as coaches, specifically offering you tips and techniques, little things that you can do that will make a big difference in the way you communicate. The ahs, the ums, and the so's, the you knows are really crutch words that we use when our brain and our tongue are not working together at the same time. The problem is they dilute our messages and they make us seem less credible and we don't want that. So what do you do about yeah. it? A couple of quick things. One is to really practice rigorously. Know your material and your content as well as you possibly can. The second thing is to really concentrate on the transitions because right. when you go from one <clears throat> thought to another, that's where they tend to show up more. And the third thing is the pause. Mm. You know, the pause is probably the most underutilized and impactful rhetorical tool that we have. So this week, your next meeting, make a point instead of the um, the so, pause. <laughs>